Well, the overall goal of the Cybersecurity Operations Center is to take students who have typically gone through an academic track, so in the classroom they've learned theory and haven't really had a lot of practical application. And what we want to do is we want to expose them to the industry best standards, practices, and tools that are out there that we currently use for our operational security staff here at the university. And we want to give them that same set of tool set. And what they'll get out of it is practical application for everything that they've learned in theory. They'll get to do it on a production environment. Uh, so they'll feel like a, a sense of accomplishment. They'll be able to provide you know, some uh, operational security for the university so that there'll be a sense of pride there as well and a job well done. And that they'll feel like they're contributing to the overall security posture of Clemson University. So I think it's a win-win for both groups. Um, they get to, to provide that for us and to be part of it and to learn. And to, when they walk away from here, they have the, not only the academic education that they got in the classroom, but have the practical, real-world experience on relevant, up-to-date, industry-best standards uh, and tools that are available to them. Clemson has quite a bit of expertise in cybersecurity, and we thought that um, having a, a living laboratory that could be both functional in that it would help us with the overall um, uh, maintain the overall integrity of the electronic security of the institution. We thought we could also use it for other purposes too, like uh, education, uh, training, and uh, also research to a certain extent. But the center itself, it's, it's really designed sort of like a command center. It's, it's uh, just shy of 600 square feet, 500 something square feet in there. The idea is that students will sit there at a, at a command desk, they'll run the applications and tools we have, they'll see the visual representation of it up on the board. Um, they'll be able to toggle between what they're doing actively between their desk and works, their workstations and put it up there for others to see and how they'll work together collectively as teams. So we thought that by blending operations and education, uh, we could help uh, students to become very practically oriented in this field find out while they were getting their education whether it was something they'd be interested in or not. And so uh, it's a bit of a test bed, it's a living laboratory, but it's also an operation that we hope will, uh, not we hope, we believe will um, uh, enhance Clemson, the integrity of Clemson cybersecurity. So the ideal students that are coming in there is all students for us. I don't want to, I don't want to think that this is just a computer science or computer engineering type student we're looking for. Obviously that's where the natural draw is going to be from because that's the students who are interested in cybersecurity today. But we really want to open it up. We've had some success in the past with our business students in management information systems. They've been very successful uh, coupling with uh, security. And I, I'm a big believer in the uh, social sciences such as psychology, sociology, things like that. Those, are, uh, those can be very successful in security too, but understanding the mindset of the, you know, the, the threat actor that's out there, helping us do profiling with them, understanding what they might be trying to attack or what they're trying to, to get at. Um, so I, across the board, the diversity, not only in when we think of race or gender, I also wanted in the academic side, the diversity and type of students that we bring in. The more that we can have in there that work as a team and they bring each or each bring their own sets of skills, it's gonna be a, a beneficial for us and for them and their experience that they've got. But we hope that uh, we, this will be a, uh, an attractor to companies to invest in uh, for interns, but also uh, to deploy uh, state-of-the-art technologies. And then I guess the third piece would be, uh, would help us to attract some research funding as well and to, uh, to uh, do some uh, cutting edge research in an operational environment. Anyone that does research in cybersecurity is thankful if they can do it in a, not in an abstract way, but in a much more uh, concrete way. But ultimately, at the end of the day, what we're trying to do is we're trying to produce graduates who leave here with practical application skills. Uh, a lot of times we, you know, in academia, we, they run through their courses, they do their coursework. We want to give them an immersive experience that they can leave with.